What's going on YouTube? Today is a super exciting day, not only for myself, but I think for the future of the channel. I've been sick for like a week now, and not like I had a little cold and I was lazy and didn't make a video. I've been like deathly ill uh, for multiple days on end, and I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. What I'm headed to do right now, I was supposed to do on Monday, it's now Thursday. I've been so excited for this for like two years. I haven't really decided how much of this I want to show you guys. I kind of want to keep it a, a little bit of a surprise. At the same time, I've never spec'd out my own car in the dealership, like gone to a Porsche store and done this. So I'm going into it uh, completely a noob. And I want to document as much as I can and give you guys kind of an idea of what it's like to build your own Porsche. Before I even go in there though, uh, one of the things I wanted to touch on is all my cars, rent, investments, vacations, all of that is paid for by developing software. I'm actually starting a software development company that's totally separate though. I make basically zero dollars every month off of YouTube. YouTube makes me no money, it's just kind of a fun thing to do. I've always kind of said like, as I make more money doing this stuff, I'll keep growing the channel. But coming with a new warehouse are more expenses. And since I make no money off of YouTube, I gotta find products that I actually somewhat enjoy and then partner up with them. One of those products is the commuter speaker from Cove. This little Bluetooth speaker I pushed on my channel before is surprisingly loud and I have a 65% off discount code, Joe65. First link in the description down below if you're interested. I legitimately use this thing way more than I thought I would. In the shower, packing orders in the garage. Basically anytime I want music that's not on my iPhone speakers but I don't necessarily have a sound system, that's where this guy comes in. This comes out to like $70 with a discount code. So if you're interested and you wanna help support me and the channel, click that link down below. Get yourself a badass product while you're at it. I get to continue forward growing this channel. Let's go get me a Porsche. T3 RS. All right, guys, here with Ramsey. Huge shout out to Ramsey and Momentum Porsche. Ramsey's actually a, a friend of ours um, that moved from San Antonio, right? San Antonio. Down here in Houston, ended up working at this dealership, and that was my connection in, uh, and, and they came through. So we're gonna go through a couple of options. I'm not gonna show you guys everything. Uh, I want it to be somewhat of a surprise, but we'll go over like the, I guess, kind of the, the important options that you wanna put on these things. I'm fucking stoked. There's literally, there's one right there. Like that's, this is what I get to look at while I'm specking out the, yeah. Really the choice between was the lizard green and the Miami. Or yellow. It is such a good job. Does that car have green interior? The uh, green. So I wanted to see, they did such a good job matching this to like, oh, it's, it's so close. You really can't even tell. This is the future of my channel. I really wanted a base GT3. I just remember this because I just, I just saw it. I really wanted a manual GT3 just because I want the manual transmission. That was like ideally what I was going for. And I know it sounds stupid to say I didn't want the RS, but obviously you don't turn down when you get offered an allocation, I don't care what it is. So I'm getting an RS now. <laughs> I, I think in the long run, I like this better. All right, my car is not red. I will tell you guys that right now, but I'm not gonna show you guys like the final spec. All right next, we got uh, interior. Okay, let's go with the Alcantara leather. Yeah, yeah. Easy enough, we got the buckets already. y -Sack package for sure. And that's basically just all the carbon fiber. I think it lightens the car by like, can you get the info? Does it tell you? Yeah, it I thought it was like 20 pounds or something. 13.4 oh, pounds. I pay $18,000 to save 13.4 pounds. You could pay me 18 grand, I just go on the treadmill and lose 13 pounds. Front axle lift is like a must in Houston if you ever actually want to drive it. Mm -hmm. And chrono package, because it looks weird without a little clock. Okay. Carbon ceramic brakes. Uh, LEDs are a must. I hate the look of those headlights. Those look so much better. Red, match the car. Okay, I'm kind of salty because this is not my spec at all, but I kind of like this spec now. I mean, you could if do you that take on European a delivery. If you go, how about, how about we both go to Porsche Experience? That'd be cool. In Atlanta? I wouldn't go to LA, I go to, no, no, I think Atlanta Atlanta's the bigger Atlanta one. Atlanta is better. It's, uh, I mean, where the headquarters is. Hold up, this is this is interesting. <laughs> Wait, so we go pick it up there. Yeah, then, on a race car track. And then when you then they ship it from there to here when I'm done? Or do I drive it from Atlanta to Houston? That's a good question. Okay, look, part of buying this car is that I can take it on the track the day I take delivery of it. Everyone always gives me shit like, oh you're you're flooring a car with no miles on it. Like I I test drove a GT3 a long time ago. 
and it was like, oh, you're going over 2,000 RPM. Like they let you take it on a track the day you buy it if you want. Like these cars, are, I, I feel like they're meant to. They're meant. Yeah. Okay. They're meant to break it in. There you go. I get that all the time. Every time I have a new car, like, oh, don't rev it over 500. You don't know what you're doing. Like, no, they, they, they want you to. We'll see how much Porsche loves me. After all these, all these years of hate, we'll see if they finally give me what I want. <laughs> a bunch of custom options. That is my final out the door price, if it'll focus. But that's that's what I'm paying, right? That's see see how right this there. is this is how Porsche stores are supposed to work. This is all the comments are like it's impossible to buy one at sticker. No, it's not. This is this is what's supposed to happen. What's the base price? 187 to 233. It's $50,000 in options. This thing better kick ass. I have a whole nother car. I have a, a nice car. I have an E-Class Mercedes bundled into that thing with all the options. It's gonna be worth it. Ooh. Okay, don't let my, my sickness fool you. I am excited as shit right now. Like I'm, I'm fucking giddy looking at the RSs that are in there right now. Unfortunately, those are sold. My car is a, I think it, they said a February build. So I should, the car should be here on the ground ready for me to take delivery. I think like June, July, which works out perfect. My birthday is June 28th. So if they could make that work out, I'd, I'd be the best birthday uh, I've ever had. Guys, huge shout out to Momentum Porsche. If you guys are looking for a Porsche, I have bashed, bashed. I have bashed Porsche stores nonstop. I've been f***ed over by like 10 stores all over the US trying to get a GT3 allocation. They're really trying to get any allocation. It's been a nightmare. They came through. <laughs> they came through. Uh, so I, I owe a lot to Momentum Porsche here. So if you're looking for a Macan or a Cayman or maybe a GT3 of your own, hit them up. The dealer's info, Rams's info will be down below. And thanks to you guys, I'm now getting my dream car, uh, specking it out the way I want. I get to work with a Porsche store hand in hand. Like, I. Thank you guys. Also, the thumbnail was this car. Photoshop skills, adding a wing and shit. Hopefully it works out. Ooh, I guess we'll see. <laughs>
Guys, I can't thank Momentum Porsche enough. I'm gonna be working with them hand in hand uh, going forward, helping them do their marketing. The manager promised me an allocation and, and two months later he came through on his word and I, I got the allocation. So I, I couldn't be happier about the situation. I'm also just really excited because I finally have a really good relationship with like my favorite brand of all time. Like what could be better than, than having a place that I can take cars for reviews and, and promote and be surrounded by the brand that I love so much. So like the video, smash that subscribe button, comment down below. My mom just walked up. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go eat. I'll catch you guys in the next one.